you welcome to another spirit filled message on christocentric message if you're new to this channel i would entreat you to hit on that subscribe button and then to like this video as well i would want you to share this message across because we believe that as this message is coming forth it's going to bless you your graces are going to be imparted onto you and then god is going to visit your home thank you for watching stay blessed the things that I'm going to be sharing with you tonight is in honor to one of these veterans. Even though he's gone to be with the Lord, he still remains a profound influence in my life and his influence remains indelible in my heart. And this is a tribute really, uh, if I would call it, to him even though he's not in the earth again but i look at the extent of his impact even on this wise over my life and i thought it was important to one more time acknowledge him and sincerely celebrate him and then we go into our discussion i'm talking about none other than dr miles munro <clears throat> hallelujah it was on a glorious morning on this very day, I was in the city of Wari, preaching at a conference when I woke up, I think I woke up to pray, early hours of the morning, and then I was told that he had died in a plane crash, and I said, what happened? Why would such a great man die in a plane crash? Um, but then he died alongside his wife, his assistant and I think their wives or so and um, it was quite an impactful loss if I would call it for the Bahamas Faith Ministry International but then he lives on today we have become extensions of his legacy I kept meditating even this morning on the many things I learned from him it was from this great man Dr. Miles that we learned the value and the excellency of purpose and that knowing your call and your assignment on time is an advantage to your life. It was from Dr. Miles Monroe I learned, for instance, that leadership is not about looking for people to lead. It's a very poor idea of leadership. Unfortunately, that is largely the idea of leadership we have in Africa. Looking for people called followers, then we lead them. He taught us and mentored us into a superior understanding that leadership is about discovering, refining, and developing your giftings and potential and deploying them to serve so effectively that your influence and your impact becomes noticed by the people within your environment and they give you as a reward the gift of loyalty. This was his definition of leadership. That leadership is about deploying your giftings to serve, not looking for men to lead. Hallelujah. Profound contributions. It was from him I understood the kingdom. His book, Rediscovering the Kingdom, has remained a classic, bringing superior ideas, taking us beyond the shores of religion and adding to our understanding. And today, by the grace of God, it is an honor to be making our own contribution to the body of Christ and even to this generation. We hope that someday if Christ tarries, someone will be able to point to our lives too and say we live meaningful lives. I hope that will be true for you. <laughs> Anytime I talk about things that relate to death, everybody keeps quiet. Why are you afraid of dying? You will not die. I've told you this. Hallelujah. I'm sure someone is saying, no, I've not built, I've not married, no way. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> So God bless Dr. Miles Munro. God bless his works. God bless his legacy in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. You will want to listen to the things that I'm teaching. And the credit for these thoughts are directly connected to this great man. Uh, quite directly connected to him. Um, I have done very little editing as far as the knowledge that I've received on this wise he helped me understand the concept of destiny so thoroughly. And there are a few questions we are going to ask and hopefully answer tonight. And I guarantee you by the integrity of scripture that the answers to this question 
will be for you a compass to a new horizon in destiny. In the name of Jesus Christ. Dearly beloved, I hope you were blessed by this message. Do not keep the video to yourself. Share to as many as you can to help them bless. Check our homepage for more of our messages. Subscribe to the channel. Comment on it. Like it. See you on our next video. Bye. Pray. Pray. Pray for your destiny. Salas kade bash kana kata branda kate katos kate branda kata bako tos koto preke te kene kata. The phase of development, Lord, grant me the discipline.